In this video we're going to see how you can view more than one photo at a time inside of Photoshop Elements like this. Notice that I have three different photos that I can see all at the same time, as opposed to being able to see only one photo at a time like this. Hi, I'm Rick from EssentialPhotoshopElements.com. Let's go over to Photoshop Elements and see exactly how this works. I'm using Photoshop Elements 11 for this video, but it will also apply to older versions of Elements that feature tab documents. Tab documents were first introduced in version 8 of Elements. You can see down in the photo bin that I have three different photos open inside of Elements. You can also see that the name of each photo is on these tabs at the top of my window. And I can click on each tab to view each photo individually but I can only view one at a time. I can view all three of my open photos at the same time by going up to the window menu and choosing images, float all in windows. But when I do that, you can see that float all in windows is grayed out, so I'm unable to select it. Here's how you can make it active. On a Mac, hold down the Command key and press the letter K. And if you're on a PC, hold down the Control key and press K. So I'll do that now. That brings up the General Preferences dialog box. From the list of options, look for the one that says Allow Floating Documents in Expert Mode. Click on it to put a check in the box next to it. In older versions of Elements, it will say Allow Floating Documents in Full Edit Mode. Just make sure that it has a check mark in the box and then click OK to close the dialog window and confirm the change. Now go back up to the window menu and this time when I choose images you'll see that float all in windows is no longer grayed out so you can click on it. And when you do all of the photos that are currently open in Photoshop Elements will each appear in their own window and you can click and drag on their title bars to move them around. And that's how you can view more than one photo at a time inside of Photoshop Elements. If you want to go back to tab view, just go back up to the window menu and choose images, consolidate all to tabs and click on it. Until next time, this is Rick from EssentialPhotoshopElements.com saying take care.